I would love it if people just ask me my gender more. I'm a gender non-conforming trans woman. People get very confused about that and they often avoid asking me about my gender identity, which I, along with most trans people, are pretty comfortable um, answering questions about. Being transgender is a broad spectrum of many different gender identities. However, it generally just means someone who doesn't identify as their sex assigned at birth. Transitioning is a really broad process. It can mean anything from taking hormones, surgery, or just being called a different name. Transition can be medical, it can be social, it can be legal. There's all sorts of different processes. Everyone transitions differently and there's as many ways to transition as there are trans people. Transgender and transsexual are usually very different terms. Many people who identify as transsexual also identify as transgender and many don't. Often, you won't want to call trans people transsexual. The term's really fallen out of popularity in the past couple decades. Transsexual often implies that our gender is a sexual orientation, which it's definitely not. And at the same time, many trans people, especially many older trans people, prefer the term transsexual because it describes them not identifying as their sex assigned at birth. It was much more popular earlier on, and what's really important is that you ask people how they prefer to be described. A dead name is what someone used to be called. Many, if not most, trans people change our names, and our old name, usually what we were born with, is what a dead name is. It's not okay to call a trans person or even mention a trans person's dead name without their permission. Many of us are okay with having that name referenced and many of us aren't. What's important is that you ask a trans person beforehand. I know that a lot of people are very touchy about how to ask about gender identity. In reality, it's super easy. You can simply just ask someone, what's your gender? Or what are your pronouns? Now, pronouns aren't necessarily the same thing as someone's gender, but you can just ask them. Um, really, there's nothing wrong with simply asking and listening. They, them pronouns are a really great way to avoid the gendered pronoun structure of English. Many trans people use singular they to describe themselves and to have other people describe them. It's an excellent way to avoid um, gendering people unnecessarily, and you're probably already using singular they in your everyday vocabulary. Supporting a trans child can be really difficult. I came out when I was eight years old, and many trans people come out even younger. There's a lot of groundwork to do for trans children. They're often bullied, harassed, and isolated in school. What's really important is that you do your readings, learn about the trans community, and perhaps more importantly, get your trans child involved in their own community. I think the number one question that trans people get that we don't want to hear anymore is asking about our genitalia. You're not going around asking people off the street, hey, like, what are your genitals like? Don't ask trans people if we've had the surgery or not. It's um, not many trans people feel comfortable talking about their genitals in public. Many trans people get gender affirming surgery and many don't. Actually, while it's commonly thought that being trans just means getting a surgery, that's only one small part of the whole transition process. In fact, the majority of trans people don't get surgery or medically transition at all. Surgery entails 
all sorts of different aspects. It depends on who you are, what type of surgery you want. In the trans community, we often call it top surgery for um, breast reduction or augmentation and bottom surgery for, well, genitals. And it really just depends on what the person wants. You're no more or less trans whether you want or get surgery or not. love it if people just ask me my gender more. I'm a gender non-conforming trans woman. People get very confused about that and they often avoid asking me about my gender identity, which I, along with most trans people, are pretty comfortable um, answering questions about. I think that there's the stigma about gender that we have in our society that causes us to not want to even bring up the topic. And with trans people, we are constantly talking about our genders and just asking us directly how we identify is a really good way to not only learn about us, but get to know us as a person.